Now, I've told you before, I learned this lesson really early, and I learned it at Huntsville Park Baptist Church, a uh, little bitty mill church where, where my family went at the time. Uh, Mr. Green was our janitor, uh, and in, he kept the... the he kept the church spotless. He waxed the floors so shiny. They were dangerous to walk on. Now, now you think I'm making that up. I'm not. I can tell you the people that I know personally that slipped and fell on those floors, yours truly being one of them. Okay? There was never any dust. There was never a scrap of paper. And if you ask Mr. Green, he would tell you, Jesus will be here Sunday. Jesus will be here Sunday. He wasn't cleaning that church for a paycheck. He wasn't cleaning it for the little brats who'd be on the back row of that church. He knew that Jesus would keep his promise, that two or three people gathered together, Jesus would be there. And when Jesus came into that church, Mr. Green wanted him to see the love that he had for his Savior and the way those floors shined. Mr. Green took work and made it into worship. Because Mr. Green changed the question he was answering. Am I being faithful to God where I am according to the people I'm with? Is the place I am markedly, qualitatively better because I'm in it? Will the Lord bless your business, your friends, simply because you're there? That's what happened with Joseph. He chose to answer a different question. He understood that there are no such things as moments that don't matter. <laughs> 